to parents, to kids, to jobs. Hey, welcome to our update. Okay, let me jump right in. Let me talk to you about our family. Yasmin is turning four in about two months. Ruben, same time, is turning two. We're having a good time. We had a pretty difficult winter behind us this past winter because Yasmin's this was Yasmin's first year in kindergarten, lots of sicknesses. Vita being home with the kids all winter was difficult, but she's very creative. She does a lot of cooking, a lot of sawing, you know, all the prince's clothes for Yasmin, because yeah, yeah, she's already picking her clothes and not liking everything. Ruben turning out to be a great kid, a real boy, definitely a boy, so we're having a good time. God is teaching us a lot, as you can see from these pictures, we have a lot of fun. Okay. Uh, let me tell you about a fun thing. Some of the students at the BI saved up money for us so that Vita and I could go on a two-day trip. They took care of the kids. It was such a joy after seven years of marriage this past April. It was a real blessing. Okay, I passed her the local church. Vita does music in the local church and it's an important ministry. We. Uh, we counsel people, I teach, I preach, uh, visit people, uh, do a lot of the foundational work for the church to be a strong uh, missions driven church. So, you know, give direction for all these people as you can see in this picture. One of the new ministries is the old folks home that we visit uh, uh, once a month with volunteers from the church. We play with them, we teach them the word of God, Christians share Christian literature and the hope of Christ. This is another, this has been a ministry going on for a while. This is the kids club ministry. As you see those four young people, students from the BI that I lead. And together we lead the Bible club of about 20, 25 kids that come every week. We share the gospel, sing songs, play games. You know, the kids version of, uh, of the gospel weekly to kids that don't know Christ yet. So you can pray for them, you know. And talk, have private conversations with them weekly. And finally, let me talk to you briefly about uh, my ministry of Word of Life. I translate classes, tons of hours of translation with the greatest guest teachers uh, from around the world. And not only in the classroom, but as you see in the last three pictures at conferences. So most of the time you see my face, which is probably not a good thing for some of you, but hey, uh, that's what I do at Word of Life. Thanks for watching. God bless you.